And now, to the triumphant musical climax of this celebration. I love Christmas. You must have heard about Scrooge, A Christmas Carol, which is a recent Netflix release, and you may be thrilled to learn more about the movie. But what does the recent release have to offer? What are the lessons you could learn from the movie? Is it worth your time? Let's find out in the video. Hey guys, today I'm going to be discussing the anime movie Scrooge. The story of Scrooge is a classic tale. Still, it's been told so many different ways over the years, from Charles Dickens' original novella, to the stage play A Christmas Carol, to the Disney animated feature film Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas. It's fun to watch if you're an anime lover or into movies with paranormal elements. So in this video, we will discuss a bit of the storyline and some classic life lessons the movie is packed with. Before we get into the lessons and opinions on the movie, make sure to subscribe to the channel and like the video. With this, let's get started. Let's begin with a brief overview of the movie storyline. Generosity and good cheer, which, conversely, brings me to you. Me? The story follows a miserly man named Ebenezer Scrooge who hates Christmas because he feels that people just use it as an excuse to be greedy and selfish. And one night, a group of ghosts visits him and show him what would happen if he continued on his current path. The ghosts show him what he was like in his life and how he'll be remembered after death if he does not change his ways. They teach him the true meaning of Christmas, and he finds love, friendship, and happiness for himself. After that, Tremendous work, my dears. Roast goose with sage and onion stuffing a la Cratchit. A legendary gourmet dish. <laughs> we get the story of Bob Cratchit, one of Scrooge's employees at his bank. Bob's family has been very poor for many years and struggles to make ends meet daily. Mr. Scrooge sees this as good business because it keeps prices low for everyone else in town. Oh, uh, Mr. Scrooge! Oh dear, I, oh, welcome back, sir. There's something I should tell you. But it also makes him very lonely because no one wants to be around him either. In short, all the characters are incredibly well-developed and each has a distinct personality. The past by toasting our present to each other, to Christmas, <laughs> to friendship. Hey, hey. To friendship! To friendship! Even if you've never read the original novel or seen any other adaptations, which I highly recommend, by the way, this movie will still hold your interest until its bittersweet ending. Let's shift our focus now from the story overview to the lessons learned from the anime. Because if I keep telling you the story, I think I'll spoil your thrill. Lesson number one. One of the many important lessons to be learned from Scrooge, A Christmas Carol, is that wealth alone is not enough to guarantee happiness. The story of Ebenezer Scrooge and the suffering of his employee Bob Cratchit's family show how true this lesson is. Scrooge is affluent. He works hard and earns his fortune entirely alone. And yet, despite his enormous wealth, Scrooge is still unhappy. On the other hand, the Cratchit situations is worsened by old Ebenezer's habit of underpaying the family patriarch, Bob. Tiny Tim, their severely crippled son, seems to be getting worse. But despite that, the Cratchit home is overflowing with warmth and love. And these are the two qualities Scrooge lacks. The Cratchits may be poor, but that won't stop them from having a Merry Christmas. Ebenezer Scrooge, the sins of man are huge, a never-ending symphony of villainy and infamy, of mischief, mayhem, misery. Lesson number two. Another great lesson that anime gives us is that if you want to learn something new and be a better version of yourself, you must be able to listen to others. Scrooge once started listening to the ghosts, which was the actual turning point of his life. He understands that ghosts are there for his goodwill and lets them teach. This makes him realize some very important things about himself, and he then starts thinking about how wrong he was before. Are all others I've been shown this night without blame? Am I the only one with the power to change my life? To change the lives of others? Well, am I? Lesson number three. We also learn that it's never too late to change yourself for good. Scrooge was an old man, but if he thought he was too old to change, he would have never been able to. So besides looking at the age or time, we must learn to accept and acknowledge our flaws and start working on improving our nature and behavior, as it's never too late to start improving ourselves for the best. It's that nephew of mine, interfering, bringing my blood to the boil. 
has been jumping at shadows, seeing things. Yes, that's it. Yes. Lesson number four. As a bonus, we also learn that asking for forgiveness is a sign of strength in the anime. Actions, rather than words, often show apologies. For instance, one day, after nearly throwing out two solicitors for the poor from his office, Scrooge makes a financial commitment to one of them. I know that wasn't simple. However, it proved that Scrooge's regeneration is the real thing. <laughs> Lesson number five. No matter how uncompromising or uncaring someone may appear on the surface, they undoubtedly have their own set of problems that weigh heavily on their minds and their hearts. We should always treat others with kindness and compassion, since we can never know what they truly may be going through at any time. Uncle, I'm all the family you have. Why does it have to be this way? Lesson number six, last but not least, the anime shows us the transformative power of love and kindness, regardless of how much we may despise or mistrust the giver. Remember that each of us has the extraordinary power to affect the lives of those around us through the words we speak and the deeds we perform. It is our responsibility to do so for the greater good. Tell me, is this what will be or what may be? If I were to change, would all this still come to pass? So in the end, I must say that I really enjoyed this movie because I think it does a great job of showing how important family can be in life. The movie is full of entertainment, suspense, and drama, and it is definitely worth the time. The future is as much a mystery to me as it is to you. I can only show you what is. What's to come? If you do not change, well. We often forget how important our loved ones are until they're gone, and then it's too late. It's also interesting how when we have people around us who make us feel bad about ourselves because they're so mean, it makes us feel worse than being alone would. With this, I think it's time to take our leave now. What's your opinion on the movie? Have you watched it? Or are you planning to watch it this weekend? Do let us know in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give the video a like. See you in the next video. Have a great time watching the movie. Well, we shall both have to find new employment. Good day. Thank you very much, Mr. Scrooge. God bless you. And a Merry Christmas when it comes. Mm, it's still the past. It is. Your mother, my beloved sister, left. I will not be joining you for Christmas dinner, nor any other celebration of this wretched season. Now please leave. <laughs>